Hi, Yano. Hi. <laughs> you are playing tonight? Uh, yes, 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 I'm playing tonight, yeah. What's it's your called, band called? The band is called Brain Dead. We are from Hamburg, Germany. Do you talk about veganism in your band? Uh, we do, we do. Um, we, we also have some songs about veganism, some which are like more, uh, more like to, to funny, you know, to the funny side. Some, one, one song which is called Soy, Not Oi. It's about I don't know, vegetarian food, vegan sausages and everything. So mm. A funny approach to it, but also being saying clearly, yeah, we, want, we are pro animal rights, pro vegan. Do you think music is a good way to spread the message about veganism? It's one way, I would say, maybe. And I think, yes, yeah, it's, it's a good way because to me, to me, like listening to music and going to, to, to shows and meeting people was kind of the way how I got introduced to a lot of politics and different way of thinking. So it's just kind of it's, Easy, accessible. I don't know if you can say it right or whatever. Because it's just like you go, just go to shows and become interested. In, because people are talking about the stuff and think about it. So it is. It's a, it's, a, it's a good way. Maybe it's not the best and the only yeah. way, but it's, it's it's a good way. I think. Yeah, so right, it's nothing. I think it will change the world completely. But mm. Maybe a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. The punk scene seems to embrace veganism. Why do you think that is? Why? Good question. Um, I think, yeah, may, maybe as I said before, because it's like part of um, try to act different and uh, don't, I don't, know, don't be an asshole or whatever and try to, to react to, to, act, to act different. And it's just like part of it. It's like, okay, I don't want to be a racist, I don't want to be sexist. And maybe it's like a, a part of the whole thinking. You are from Hamburg? I'm from Hamburg, yeah. So what's it like being vegan in Hamburg? Oh, it's, it's getting way, way, way better. It's, it's totally okay. It's like, it's pretty easy. You can go to any supermarket, you will you find some vegan stuff. Not but just like fruits or whatever, but yeah. like, I don't know, tofu, soy milk or rice milk. So it's, it's getting more and more and more supermarkets. So getting, yeah, they're getting even vegan cheese in supermarkets. It's, um, so it's, it's kind of easy. And if you go to a restaurant, probably, all of them have as least vegetarian dishes. Mm. Some might have vegan, but there are also a lot of vegan restaurants in Hamburg. More and more coming. Berlin is actually a little bit better for vegan restaurants in Germany than Hamburg, but Hamburg is kind of it's coming. More yeah. More. Why do you think veganism is on the rise? Because um, Germany is known for kind of being like a meat-eating country, yeah, and true. suddenly yeah, there's a lot of it, it, vegans it, it, about. It, it is still, I think. Um, why it is rising, I think that most people which which are buying maybe just vegan cheese or whatever in the supermarkets, they are maybe not like full-time vegans, maybe mm. they, they just try, I think a lot of them just to try something different and sometimes eat vegan, not all the time. I think that's like where a lot of people, why, why these, like these products are more and more spread around. Um, yeah, I don't know. Actually, I'm also surprised by so many people. <laughs> and I don't know if it's really good reason. It's like still, still a lot of people eating meat. And meat is kind of like mm. still there. But um, yeah, it's good. It's more, 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 more like I don't know, it's a daily thing. Yeah. To be vegan. It's not like I, I, remember, uh, I remember the first first time I was questioned a lot. Like, why, why are you doing this? I'm not understanding it, and now you just. I just feel it's changed and it's more like you say you I'm, I'm vegan and people say oh, okay right okay yeah yeah mm. sort of like, it's like not, not that big deal anymore. Veganism is sometimes seen as quite extreme. So what's the most extreme thing you've done in your life? Yeah, good question. Um, uh, I I don't really know. I never went bungee jumping or anything with like this, and I'm not kind of a super extreme <laughs> person who's like into street fights or I don't know um, I don't know maybe, maybe it's the amount of cider I've been drinking since I'm in England yeah <laughs> maybe I, I don't know something like this you tour a lot with your band do you find it hard to find vegan food while you're touring no actually, actually in Germany it's it's really good food wise like people are cooking like it's kind of common to, to have food been cooked at shows and, mm. um, Usually it's, it's vegan and um, we always have in contact, we always say it, it's like not a big deal. Mm. Like, no, it's, it's, Germany is good, 
England is also okay because we've been here a few times, and so I, I know a lot of some of some places where you go and other to get stuff. Uh, France is kind of hard. It's like the cliches about French kitchen. Are, some points they are a bit, a bit true. I don't know, but it's mm. really it's hard to find something vegan in France. That's cool. Well, thank you. Thank you for being interviewed. <laughs> Why do you become vegan? Uh, pretty much because of politics, I think. Because um, listening to punk and becoming, I don't know, involved in the punk scene and by that introduced to politics and stuff, and then it just became, I don't know, it was part of the whole different way of thinking. Uh, it's kind of, it's, uh, it's kind of, I think, standard story, unsolved story. So do you have any tips for people that want to go vegan? I don't know. Maybe don't don't be, be too hard to yourself or whatever. Mm. Like, I don't know. Take it easy. It's, I don't know. It's, it's your your decision. You, you you decide how to do it or whatever. And don't put too much pressure. And maybe don't don't try to try to create your whole identity again around it. Because like, I feel sometimes people are doing this like a lot. Like it's like core part of their identity or whatever. It's like it's just a part of what, what, what I'm doing. What, yeah.